So, alrighty guys, so welcome to Pal World, where today I'm going to be mostly just trying to complete the tutorial here, and then hopefully from there, next episode we should be able to continue on. So, this game I have played a little bit, I did already do like half the tutorial, and learn some stuff so I at least know what I'm doing here at the start, so that way we can kind of just, you know, speed through this a tiny bit. Uh, and talk to her, and she'll give us a bunch of sticks. Okay. Basic supplies. Thank you. Now, what we need to do is open up our survival menu. Go to the survival guide. Just gotta scroll through this here to get it to pop. And then, of course, we got the build menu down here, and... Uh, if you hit B, I can open up the build menu, but there's a PAL sphere. This is basically the way we catch these guys. And so, we'll just do this real quick and show you. You can just knock this out. Using your hands is probably not the best. I should have made like a wooden club, which is an option. And then boom. Hopefully he goes in. Most of the time when it's already at 90, it's tame. But there is still a chance that it will fail. Okay, so... I need to build the table. I got all the wood. It has a nice little building mechanic here as well, where you have to hold down F here to construct. Um, but if you get enough pals, eventually you can just automate that stuff. Uh, but you have to find like certain pals because they each do their own little jobs. So, some of them will farm, some of them will mine, some of them will build. Some of them will just do nothing and run around. That is legit what they do sometimes. Uh, oh yeah, it's a C. Boom. Okay. Now, open up the technology screen. Alright, before I do that, what I would like to do in this game before we really get started... Also, I gotta con close the build menu. What I'd like to do is find where I'm gonna put up my base. So... I don't think we want to do anything with down here. There is some collectibles around the world, though, that's just laying around. So I can run over here and grab this little journal. So. Yeah. And we do have, like, the Breath of the Wild's climbing mechanics and all that in the game. Which I find really fun to use. I mean, they're very helpful. Um, what was that? Ooh. I started to fall. Boom. I landed on that chicken. Surprised it didn't get mad at me. You would probably get mad if somebody jumped on your head. Okay, I got me another little cat here. Boom. That was 100% right on impact. So we got us another little pal here. I haven't even had to craft one of these pal spheres yet. Pal spheres yet. Oh yeah, this is what I was running for. There's this green little thing over here. I got a bunch of them last time, but I don't know what they do. I got like six of them. Uh. Oh, that improves my ability to capture. All right, it just said so there on the left. So eventually, I have to turn them into the Statue of Power. I guess that's a structure I have to find or make. Something like that. Um, I think, since I am just looking for a flat spot to build my base right now, that area right there would be perfect. This area right in here. Again, it is flat. Ooh, that is a... Mammoth? Is that a mammoth? Mammoth forest? Mammoth forest? You're too big for me to tame. I'm going to just say that right now. So, let's get over here. We're going to place down the bench again. A little workbench. Um... Just throw it back here up against the wall. Or the stone wall. Stone cliff, not wall. Okay, so once I do that, it's going to want me to open it up and craft some PAL spheres. Technology. Grab that. May as well grab this while I'm in here. I'll grab some certain stuff. I'm just grab my tier 2 tech. Okay. We're done with that for now. Boom. Okay. 
forgot. Go here. Now for a pal sphere, I need more stone so I can make a pickaxe so I can mine some rock to get stone. Because there's some of them over there. There's blue rocks that we see you see lying around. That is uh That is the pal was it what is it called? Palladium? It's the resource we need here to uh craft the pal spheres. Now, I did also learn this. There is a creature that you can get. And, again, it's a, one of the ones that just kind of wanders around and does nothing. Except, there's an option to have creatures graze. So, if you have... And it's one of those creatures that can graze. If you put this one in there to graze, uh... What happens is he'll generate arrows and pal spheres and coins for you. Which I found awesome. Right? That was very helpful. But then I decided to restart, so that way you guys get to experience this with me. Um, I need stone for the pal spheres. Okay. This should be pretty easy. Okay, I got a lot of palladium. Uh, doom. We're just gonna make all four of these spheres at once. Luckily, you can just hold it down and that makes them. Um, another thing that we can do, again, is pals will, when you get them, they'll run over here and do this for you. So, okay, build a pal box. Okay, what do I need for my pal box? Wood, of course. Uh, I need to make me an axe, which I need wood for that. Looks like we gotta go back to our roots. Punching trees. Okay, so I got my pal box building now. Sorry, guys, I had a phone call. Luckily, it was not that important. Here we go, we got that finished. That's complete. Now what I can do here is I don't want you just straight up mining the whole time because that's going to make a lot of rocks. Lamb ball. You can run around the base. Uh, Katavi, you will become our fighter. You will help me tame stuff. Okay. I got to consume some food to stave off hunger. Boom. Okay. And I got unused skill points. Okay, get one in there and two more in my weight. Okay, that's perfect. Alrighty. Now, what do we got? Gotta get five lamb balls, 30 pals. So basically, now I'm on to just level up and get stuff. So I gotta get my base to level seven. Um, I wanna go find some of these, ball these lamb balls. And we're gonna go just knock some of them out with the club. And uh, tame them. Alrighty, so i am almost got all the lamb balls I need. This should be the last one. But I'm down here in an area where I'm starting to see some new pals. I haven't really seen these guys yet. Um, so I've seen the fox over there before. I've seen the deer, but I've not seen this mud guy. And I'm going to tame him. Because he's leaf and ground. That's their type. They're, that's a normal type. Good, it's slow. Means it can't run. Okay, hold up. We're gonna need the cat to hold you off. Alright, cat, hit him. Right, hold up, we gotta catch him. There we go, that should catch him. And now, hopefully, we should be able to see what he offers. There's a bunch of them down there on the beach. Ooh, there's an egg. Um. Alright, we'll hold off on getting the egg. Because what I was originally doing here was we're just going to do the pals, get our base up to level 7, and then challenge the boss at the next, or at the tower. What's, ta oh, I'm guessing it's that. That looks like a tower. Are you the boss? King oh, wait, that's king of the forest. Does that mean you're the boss? This area? Am I good to approach you? I think you're like all pal a good chunk of the pals. Not all the pals are friendly. Some of them are aggressive, but this one looks like it's in neutral. So it won't actively go and trying to eat me. Oh. Let's try and tame one of these foxes. Ooh, they lit me on fire. Oh, you had to hit the deer. Why did you have to hit the deer? Yeah. 
Oh no. Ow. Ow. I might burn to death to this guy. Oh, do I not have balls? I don't have any. Oh, I'm all out. Oh, they killed me. Oh no. That's my bad. That is my bad. I should have made sure I had balls on me. I did not have any. Which is surprising. I thought I had some. Um, Do I have the resources one? I don't. I might need to go... Alright, all right. so. Let's actually properly set up a base. Where'd my axe go? Did I drop my axe? Oh, there we go. Okay, so I've done a little bit of work here around the base, and now we're upgrading it to level 2. Now I need to make a shoddy bed. I think, though, I will. I, for me to actually properly use the bed, I need to make a shelter to put it in. Okay, I got me a nice house here so far. Last step, though, got to go put a roof on. Um, problem, though, is roof snapping is not that easy in this game for some reason. And I keep on hitting left click on accident when I need to hit right click to continuously build. Come on. Boom. There we go. And now we have a little hut to live in. Nice. And you are picking berries for me. And you're putting them in this storage box. Okay. Um, Just because I have it right now and I'm thinking of it. Craft me some of these while you're at it. Okay, now, just so that way I can fill out the creature data on them, I'm going to tame the chickens. Even though they're only really good for, like, farming. There we go. And then, I gotta get me some more wood now. Alrighty. So, I'm getting me a bow now. What I think I should focus on right now is getting my 30 pals and reaching level 7. And so, yeah. So that's the bow. Now, arrows. Gotta just make as many of these as I can. Okay. I need probably more stone here. But, boom. Produce. Okay. So, I think I'm ready for my next base upgrade here. That, yep. There we go. Base is upgraded. I'm gonna show you guys what I did. I made my pals some beds over here. Crafted a repair bench. And made a fire pit. And that's mostly it. So, uh, getting these to upgrade is actually fairly easy. Like right now, it's just build a feeding box. All right, what do I need? Oh, don't need anything. Already have it. You know where I'm going to put it? Uh, let's put it over here where my pals are going to sleep. That way their food is close by. And then, of course, I got my sheep that run over and help me. And then I can open this up. And then this is where they'll start putting berries to store. I put all the be these berries in there. Okay. Make me some food for later. I don't need it right now, but it would be helpful once I get it. Okay. And then pal box upgrade available. Boom. Build berry plantation and deploy a pal to work the base. Okay, I need to deploy two more pals. Boom. Now, you guys don't have any farming, but you do. Um. Okay. So, I was trying not to go do this. I think I gotta go do a little bit of an exploratory uh, pal hunt. So we just go explore the world. We get one, just the smaller pals, you know. <coughs> oh, sorry. I just punched my bike. I'm trying not to cough on you guys. I, I'm still getting a little, like, you know, just because of the weather. I still got a cough and all that. Uh, can I take these from you? No. I got to wait for him to be done with those. And then I got to make actual, like, pal balls. Okay, I just deployed my cat. So he's going to mine for me. And hopefully that gets me some stuff. Now, I do also have three sheep just wandering around, and hopefully 
they will just start picking up the rocks and taking it over. There is a little bit of a bug, and I will say it, with the pals when it comes to like transporting stuff. Sometimes they get like confused if there's too much stuff on the ground. And yeah, eventually like they'll just sit there, pick it up, pick it up. Then you just got to run over and manually pick it all up to fix them. So, again, early access game. And the best part is, is I know a lot of people are saying like Nintendo's going to strike this game down. Nintendo, this game has been in production for like openly for a year. Okay. So we've known about this for over a year. If Nintendo had any legal grounds to send any sort of legal action against this game, they would have done it by now. Just saying. Okay, so what I've been doing here is that guy's getting me a bunch of stone. I'm getting me a bunch of wood. I'm making a lot of pal spheres, and I'm going to make me some cloth armor here eventually. i got to go hunt some sheep here. I can probably go do that here as well. Actually, I can go do that now because I'm good. I, I need wood, but this would be better to do right now. More efficient. Gotta get them before they can run. Boom, boom. I missed an arrow. Oh no! Don't hit me. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Get all of the loot. Did you drop any? Oh, look at them just roll away. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Alright, I gotta go make me clothes now. Alrighty, so I'm kind of just upgrading a little crafting area here, because I keep on finding myself wanting to make multiple things at once. So I'm gonna place down three little crafting stations here. So that way I can kind of, you know, multitask with these. Is, did you guys not want to work and build this one? What? Alright, I got it. So. Um, why can't I get anything out of this one? Oh, I think I know what I did. I got to put a bit of a space in between them. And we'll just go with two for now, because I think three might be a little overboard. We don't need that much. Is it this? Is it this that's too close? Yeah, I think it's that. So, that's what the problem was. Okay, so you make me 11 of those. You make me all three of that. I gotta go clean up my inventory here a bit. And then... Okay. We got a level. Uh, that's one thing I need to do as well. Is I need to go properly set up my uh, stats. Or I need to go do my stats again. We got more, three more stat points. Stamina. We're just going to dump it all into stamina because that's what I'm needing. Okay, I got a little bit of a problem here. I need rocks. They're all sitting out here because they're not picking them up because I'm having them craft stuff right now. And these guys kind of move slow while they're hauling. Ooh, outfit. Thank you. I got clothes now. Boom. Okay. Uh, more arrows. That's cause just what I need. I'm just producing ammo. I need ammo. Okay. Um, how are we doing on pal spheres? We got thirty. We should be good. Um. Okay. Got to clean out my inventory again with all this rocks. Don't need that many rocks on me. Okay. Cloth going there. I'll cook this meat as well, so I have food. So. Luckily, boom, boom. Here we go. Okay, so I just got the PAL gear workbench and the statue. Um, that might be good. But we also got, ooh, what did I, I don't want to unlock signs. I want this. Then a bat. Nice, but we got a fire bow. We got an upgraded bow. That might be good. Um. Yeah, we're starting to get really upgraded there now. Um, but I need to go do some, we need to go get some pals. And I'm all set up to go do that now. I think we're ready. I got food, I got arrows, I got everything we need. What we're going to do is we're going to just, 
I forgot my cat. I need my cat. I know he's been breaking rocks and we can probably give him a break right now. Because he's just been breaking rocks. Uh, but he's my he's my lead. My lead. Alright, the sheep can all go to work. My little sheep army. Um, need to find new creatures. Okay, so we got some fire foxes down over there. And we got a penguin. And then we got a mega... That's one of the first rideable creatures. I know that. Because I did the... I was able to ride one. Okay. We got to get these guys' attention. Okay. I have to dodge. Okay. Okay, that's two. We can get these penguins here probably as well. I'm going to bust out my cat though to help. Okay, that's one. Ow, that one hit me. Okay, that's a 20% capture rate. He's gonna kill that penguin. I need this one. I thought that one got captured. We're good here. I'm gonna watch it. Make sure it goes in this time. Yes! Good. Alright, what do these penguins drop? I got a feeling it's like... Alright, pal fluid and ice organs. There's a pal ball over here on the ground. There's a sh oh, that's one of my sheep that fell when I was fighting. Or when I hunted them. Okay, so we got a penguin. You're too big. There's no way I'm taming that one right now. Out, It's out of my size. Alright. Where's that? Where'd that big sheep looking one go? There it is. Okay. Cadavy, come on. We gotta do this. Arrow. Boom. Boom. What is shooting me with ice? Oh, you... I'm already out of arrows. Cataby. Gotta get this penguin. Okay. Now, I gotta tame this without killing it. Okay. Ow. Okay, 30%. Let's see what this does. Okay, hopefully. Yes! Yes! Perfect. Alright. Unfortunately, I'm out of arrows. So I gotta run back to the base. I thought I had a good, good amount, but apparently I did not. But we got two of them. Um, We got two new creatures. It's perfect. So what I'm gonna do is... Kadavi, come on. And... We're going to head back to the base. Hopefully, I can craft up the saddle for uh, the sheep. I'm pretty sure I got all the stuff to do that. Alrighty, guys. So, we're back at the base. I need to... Ooh. A little bit, little bit short on some stuff. Uh, and, well, what that might mean is... That might be it for today. Just so that way I can go take a break. Here, go get this video edited and posted because all you guys had for today is halo and halo is just kind of be like we're gonna post that until it's done and then we might do another halo i don't know um but ancient civilization parts an egg incubator that's what i need to hatch the eggs that's the ancient technology but apparently i got a saddle for the what is it melipass the sh giant sheep and the fox Parks harnessed. I can wield it like a flamethrower? 
What? Okay. That's actually kind of dope. Um, is my base upgradable? No, because I need to make a berry plantation. Food. We're short on wood. Alrighty. Yeah, that's probably going to be it for this episode, guys. So I will catch you guys in the next one.